Hey, Mike Ashcraft here with Christians Get Rich. Today I want to talk about inflation. We're having some extraordinary inflation. 9% here in America right now, and it's terrible. And so inflation is yet another excuse for why you can't save and invest. You already had a hard enough time making your budget work. Please stand clear. The doors are closing. And now inflation hits and your budget is even worse. And so you can't save and you can't invest. And this is what you say. So I want to give you some tips on how to beat inflation. I have three tips today. There are many, many more. Put in the comments if you have another one. All of my tips start with a B and they're it. And the first tip is bus it. So you can see I'm getting on the metro train here in Los Angeles. And by going on the bus and on the train, I am literally saving up about $100 a month. You say, well, that's not too much. That's 1200 in a year. And 1200 in a year is something you can invest. Bus it. Somebody says, oh, but that it wastes too much time. Well, what I do is I get up my computer and I read my books and I pray. I even network. And so I make use of the bus time. So it's not a loss of time. Bus it. Second recommendation for you is to brown bag it. Bring your food from home. Again, I'm saving about a, another hundred dollars by bringing my food from home and not going out to McDonald's, not going out to Carl's Jr., not going out to these restaurants every time for lunch. I bring it from home, brown bag it. I'm saving another hundred dollars. At the end, year's end, that's about a thousand two hundred dollars. Final recommendation, brew it. Don't get those expensive coffees at Starbucks. Brew your coffee and you can still get that uh, pick me up and not be paying out so much of your money. Now this one, surprisingly, saves me almost $200 a month. So that's, that's um, $2,400 by year's end. Total savings at the end of the year, $4,200. And that's only three ways to tighten the belt, be a cheapskate, save money that you can invest. If you want to get rich, part of the strategy is investing. If you're not investing, you're not going to get rich. If you have the patience to invest through years, you can get rich. And so I hope these strategies are helpful. You put in the comments, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, put in the comments what you do to save money, give some suggestions to your fellow viewers. We'll catch you next time on Christians Get Rich.